Hi, welcome to Blue Prism Tutorials. My name is Amir. This is part 3, installation process for Blue Prism software. In this session, we will learn what are the prerequisites for Blue Prism software. Next, we will see how, what are the steps to install Blue Prism software. First of all, we'll see what are the prerequisites for the Blue Prism software to install on our desktop. We required Windows operating system, Microsoft.NET Framework, and then Microsoft SQL Server database. First of all, we required Windows operating system on our desktop or the laptop. So Blue Prism will support Windows XP, Windows 7, Windows 8.1, and also Windows 10. So how can I check it out my system or the, my desktop or my laptop having which is related to the Windows? So we'll go for computers and then we'll right click on the computers and then we'll see the properties. If you see the properties, so this is the Windows 7 Ultimate which is uh, installed on my desktop or the laptop and the system type is 64-bit and I'm having installed memory is 4GB RAM okay these are all the things the information related to my desktop or the laptop next we'll check it out the dotnet framework is installed or not on my laptop how can we go ahead we'll go for the programs and features by clicking app with cpl it will read us to programs and features there you can check it out by clicking microsoft framework in my system microsoft dotnet framework 4.6 already installed let us assume if it is not installed on my desktop or the laptop, how can I go ahead and proceed further? So I will go for Microsoft.com. This is the official portal for Microsoft.com. And then you will go for the download center. Then I will go for developer tools. Then if I scroll down, there's a Microsoft.net 4.4 and it there. Click on that. Download, uh, select the language as English or whatever the language that we required and then download. Once it has been downloaded successfully, okay, please follow the wizard to run the Microsoft.NET 4.5. If once you have installed successfully, you will find in programs and features with the Microsoft.NET 4.5 related SDK. Next, we will install Microsoft SQL Server database. So that is we are how we can download it same way we'll go for the microsoft.com we'll go for microsoft.com and then we'll search over here for sql server we can install uh, sql express or the later versions i will install the latest version i have a, i'm installing sql server 2016 in my system if you want to know how to install SQL Server, please watch my previous video. It will explain you how to install and other things. Now we will see how to install Blue Prism software. Blue Prism software is not available for download. There are two types of getting the software. Directly, we are going to buy from the Blue Prism or else your client has to share if you're working in a company. Okay. So Blue Prism installation software is 64 or 32 bit depending upon our OS. Right now we have seen, you know, in my system as 64 bit. So for that reason, we're going to be installing 64 bit installer that is Blue Prism 5.xxx version for the 64.mis version. So how can we get the download for the Blue Prism software? So first we'll go for the blue portal.blueprism.com. I have already opened it bottle.blueprism.com so if you're already having username username and password you can go ahead and you can download directly or else go to sign up here and then provide all the required details for that in the email id please provide the corporate account so that you will get the downloads over there so i have already downloaded on my system so that i'm having blue prism 5.0 version for the 64 installer now to install that please follow the wizard double click on the blue prism dot blue prism software do you want to run this file yes run so it will allow us welcome to blue it will give the welcome to blue prism setup wizard and then you will click on next this is the license agreement you are going to read it please read it carefully 
after that I agree and then click on next wherever you want to install the folder the installation folder select it and installing blueprism for yourself or for anyone which who uses this computer so i'm just selecting everyone and then click on next and finally it will say confirmation for the installation click on next it will take a couple of seconds and then it will complete successfully Installation has been completed successfully. Click uh, close to exit. Now, if you go on your screen, if you see on your desktop, you will find an icon with the name Blue Prism. That means the installation has been completed successfully. Double click on that one, and Blue Prism version 5 will be opened successfully. Thank you for watching this video. Have a great day.